Well, now into our second year of the pandemic, and we're starting to learn now that doctors are noticing long-term effects in some young people who have COVID-19. News Channel 9's Julia LeBlanc joins us now live in the studio with this preliminary medical information because, Julia, I'm sure doctors don't really know much at this point. That's right, Nicole. Now, they can only tell us for now what they're noticing, but there's some pretty good science behind why this is happening and how many people it's impacting. We reached out to folks on Facebook and and for weeks, I've been getting emails from COVID long haulers who they themselves are dealing with these long-term health effects. So we brought this to Dr. Russell Silverman with St. Joseph's Health. And he tells me he's seeing a number of young patients ranging from 20 to 50 years old who have had COVID and now six months later are still seeing side effects. Those symptoms are heart palpitations, dizziness, shortness of breath, which Dr. Silverman says even if you measure their oxygen levels, it's normal, but they have the sensation of shortness of breath, plus brain fog and stomach and digestion issues. Dr. Silverman says you don't have to have had a severe case of COVID to see these long-term symptoms, but it's more likely in those that did. So why young people? Well, he says it's because they have more active immune systems. So what's happening to these patients is that they try to go do something that they were able to do six months ago, but they can't because their heart rate goes up so fast, it becomes counterproductive to increasing the amount of blood that gets pumped by the heart. They get fatigued, they get dizzy, their blood pressure drops, and they just can't do what they did. And Dr. Silverman wants these patients to know you are not alone. At this time, it is expected that these symptoms will eventually go away, but he says don't ignore them right now. Call your health care provider, push for answers, and ask for help.